As placed in the local newspaper on Thursday, the notice seeks public objections on the sale of the house to Council's Acting Chief Executive Officer Reinhold Evanson by private treaty. Approached by NAMPA on Friday, Evanson denied any corruption or wrongdoing, saying it is the standard procedure explaining the purpose of the notice. Allegations by some members of the public on social media is that the notice has clear elements of corruption, specifically pointing to an apparent conflict of interest as Evanson is the buyer and objections are channeled through his office. The notice drew the attention of Job Amopanda, a land activist who posted it on his Facebook page with the caption, The True One, Center of Power, Totally Amazing, only in Namibia, where a person buying a plot is the same person placing the advert and reaching for objections. Evanson, who has currently been renting the same house for more than five years, said, unfortunately, he is the acting CEO and, by procedure, all objections should go through the office of the CEO. This, he claims, does not mean he will be part of receiving objections or have any influence because he is the buyer in this case. Evanson says to avoid conflict of interest, the town council placed Selma Chasses to handle the correspondence. Evanson also hit back at critics by saying instead of going to social media, these members of the public should have done the right thing by sending objections to his office. Objections are forwarded to the Minister of Urban and Rural Development, Sophia Shaningwa, who will then make the final decision on whether Evanson should buy the house or not. Approached for comment on Saturday, Shaningwa said she is still to hear the actual story from the Usakos Town Council before making a public statement. Evanson said the house on an ervan measuring 1,118 square meters was offered to him by the council for $220,000.